Patrick, big win in your 150th game. Pretty good night. Great night, Kat. Uh, a hell of a, a lot better than my 100th. We lost by 73, so uh, a very good performance by the place tonight. It's about a 160-point turnaround. That's, uh, that's fair effort. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. It's always better celebrating milestones uh, with victories rather than losses. A couple of big wins in a row now. Nice to build some momentum going into a really important few weeks. Yeah, it does. Uh, and as you said, this uh, this next two weeks, you know, this decides whether we, we're good enough for finals or not. So our destiny is in our own hands. So uh, it's up to us. So a good three-week period, but it means nothing if we can't continue it. So uh, it's good form to be carrying into this West Coast game, and I think anything can happen if we play our best footy. Now, are you aware in the second quarter when you took that uncontested mark, you actually stopped to rearrange your hair before you took the mark? Can you comment on that, please? Uh, well, it's pretty nice hair. <laughs> well, it's it's a bit of it's not like look at Riley Knight's hair. Look at this. It's just shaved out of the sides and just some sort of like mushroom on top. It's a performance cut, mate. Performance cut. I figured just get it out of my eyes. Just make sure when I'm having a set shot that it's just you know back in, in place. Gatsby. Great Gatsby. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I like it, yeah. I uh, yes, can answer the question. What about the Chief? He's had 32. I'm, I'd have to check the stats books. I think that might be a career high in his 50th game tonight. Yeah, the, the Chief is phenomenal. Obviously, Joshy Jenkins has played on his man all night, so uh, I'm sure the this will remind him of that. But uh, no, Tommy was sensational tonight. And he's had an unbelievable year. He's such an important player for us across that half forward line. And uh, his work rate is unbelievable. And um, you know, he's really getting the rewards and he's become such a vital cog for us down there. Now the scores have obviously been pretty big the last couple of weeks, but also pleasing to keep the opposition to six tonight on the back of eight goals the previous two weeks. That defence is really the, the cornerstone of our game. Yeah, and that's where it all starts. Um, the more successful sides are really solid defensively. So we weren't terrific in that first quarter, obviously. Um, so that's an area that we can improve on. Um, but after quarter time, we really nullified their attack and we're able to create attack of our own, which is pleasing. And the Texans kicked a career best seven tonight as well? Yeah, he well, was, uh, was brilliant down there and um, providing a real focal point for us, uh, which was nice to see. Now, obviously, it hasn't been your problem, but how good is it to be this up? Uh, yeah, poor old Gaz. But I tell you what, it was bloody sensational when he came on. Provided a bit of a spark when, uh, when obviously the game was, was pretty much done, but uh, he provides great energy in that role. And another 47,500 here tonight. The fans just keep turning up. Yeah, they've been unbelievable all season. Even when we haven't been in great form, uh, their support means a huge amount um, for us as players. And we really do play better when they turn up and, and watch us, which they always do. So, uh, you know, they've been terrific all season and hopefully they turn up next week, which I, I'd imagine they would. How about yourself? How much does the 150 mean to you? Uh, it's certainly a nice little uh, milestone to tick off. Um, I remember my first game, and it's amazing how quick it all does go. Uh, but it doesn't, it doesn't mean a huge amount if you don't win. So the, the most pleasing part, obviously, is, is winning the game. You can celebrate with your teammates that way. West Coast next week, it could uh, seal a final spot or almost rule it out. It's just a huge game. Yeah, it is. And as I said, our destiny is in our own hands. So, um, you know, I don't think the players will need any motivation this week to get up and play good footy. Obviously, West Coast have been one of the best sides all year. But I'm confident if we play our best footy, we start... Uh, the game well and we defend well, uh, we're good enough to get the job done. Well done, Paddy. Thanks, Kat. Cheers.